What it is, what it do, you guys? It's your boy Kate the Former, and we're back in the building today for a very much, a very much anticipated project to react to uh, Marvel's WandaVision. After a long hiatus, uh, the MCU is back kicking off Phase 4 uh, with a project that has everyone talking. I don't know what about, uh, but it has them talking. In any case, it's uh, supposed to be a show that's way out there. Uh, nobody really knows what's going on, uh, which is actually right up my alley. If you guys know me, um, I'm all about the weirdness. Um, I'm all about the extraness. I mean, you can tell from the trailers that it's well outside of the vein of the run-of-the-mill MCU paradigm. Um, so kudos to them for being so bold. Uh, hopefully, it doesn't suck. <laughs> Peeps, if you are new here, I do all kinds of reactions and reviews for all of your favorite movies and TV shows. So please click on that like and subscribe button to not miss out. So guys, episodes one and two were released at the same time. So we're going to react to both of those back to back. Without further ado, we're already getting trippy here. They're already getting trippy with the logo. No intro, no explanation. We're just getting right into the weirdness. Oh, come on, Vision. My husband and his indestructible head. Indestructible head, maybe. We all know Vision doesn't have an indestructible time stone. Hello! Hello. <laughs> they all have their powers still. I don't eat food. Well, that explains the empty refrigerator. Bro, what's going on? The first time we have ever celebrated this... Oh, so now he can uh, shape shift his face into a real person. I'm Agnes, your neighbor to the right. My right, not yours. Where you They're from? going all in with this laugh track. Yeah, it's called her powers. So what's this? How many years? Well, it feels like we've always been together. Luckily uses how to goose your wife so you don't lose your wife. <laughs> I like Agnes. She's a uh, she's just as weird as them, but uh, she's selling it to me. I was gonna ask him the same thing. He really kept the name Vision. What's wrong with you, son? Have you got a screw loose? Oh no, sir. Screws all tightened, sir. Action is to impress the wife. And to impress the husband. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're like 10 minutes into the show, and they're not deviating from this whole 1940s sitcom uh, shtick. Right? Like the acting, the dialogue, the set pieces. Um, they're even introducing new characters and have somewhat of a storyline for this episode already. So it's safe to say we're in this for the long haul. Machine has some shine. You said it. So we got Stark. We got Stark Industries in here. All right, that's a clue. That's an Easter egg. Remember that. And I guess also uh, before Stark was making missiles and bombs and weapons for the U.S. Army, uh, he was making toasters. Toasters. Guess who? What? Nice cover, Vision. Nice cover. How exotic. We don't break bread with bullshit. Lost her accent, though. Kitchen for a moment, sweetheart. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, Wanda was trying to get it on. I don't want to be unappreciative. Uh, it is a great outfit. Lifesaver. Uh, what kind of housewife would I be if I didn't have a gourmet meal for four just lying? I just preheat the oven then. To that you. won't be necessary. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Agnes is a treat. I love Agnes. They are really deep into this sitcom. <laughs> Should I let Agnes stay and help? Well, the chicken is no longer a chicken, and the lobsters just flew the coop, so the steak is the last man's. 
The show is so goofy. I can't take it. Oh, my, my head is spinning. Oh, Mrs. Hart. That, that would make both what of us, spinning? Mrs. Hart. Speaking. Now, what are we going to eat? Dinner is served. For dinner. You were saying? Why don't you have children yet? <laughs> I think what my all questions they don't want to answer. To well, move from where? Married when? No, patients are to. Why? It's a time paradox. Damn it! What? Should have just ate your food, old man. Stop it! Should have just ate your food. I don't Stop think he's joking, it. Mrs. Hart. Stop it! This is creepy. Stop it! Stop it! Stop okay. It. <laughs> all right. <laughs> thank you for coming. <laughs> you know, the jokes aren't so bad. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Yay, go vision. Brother, do that. Today could be our anniversary. Of what? Surviving our first dinner party? Aww. I do. Do you? And they lived happily ever after. Okay, but did they, though? Babs, Digby, A. Brown, Leonard, Hooper. Any of these names ring a bell to any of you guys? Now we're back to the reality. Is this really the credits sequence? It's kind of long. Okay, so this is the actual credit sequence. So yeah, remember when I was saying um, that this show is supposed to be out there and super weird? Um... I couldn't have predicted that weird. That was that was a lot. Like I thought they were gonna break at some point out of the whole sitcom y uh parody thing, but they played it off like it wasn't a parody. Like this was the actual show. And through the trailers, you know we're gonna go through different like time periods and based off different like TV shows and uh stuff of that sort. So you know we're not gonna stay in this timeline, but uh, it's apparent they're not going to really let us know what's going on until much later in the series. Which is cool. I want it to be a mystery, but I still want it to be entertaining, which this episode was for me. So, episode two! Previously on WandaVision, we are an unusual couple. Wanda? Yes, dear. Are you... No! One of us should really determine the source of that sound. Yeah, Vision, be the man of the house. Or the android of the house. This is better, isn't it? Mm. Oh, come on, Vision. She's yes. giving you signs. Get the light. That a boy. Oh, bro, a whole cartoon intro as well. What is this? I Love Lucy parody or something? One division, one, one division. It is kind of a bop, I'm not gonna lie. Stir of Enigma, make my captivating assistant glamour. Just okay, hold on, stop the show for a minute. These two are supposed to be the strongest members of the Avengers in the MCU. Just making sure, as we were. You really are very dashing. Thank you, darling. They are kind of a cute couple, though. I mean. Even without the whole 90s, 40s sitcom thing. Oh, that's actually the rest of your costume. <laughs> okay, so that doesn't belong there. What does it mean? A red helicopter? Had a sword logo on it. I like Agnes, but I'm starting not to trust her. I feel like she's somehow a part of all this. That's <laughs> good. She's definitely up to something. I guess Dottie's the uh, HBIC. So you agree? What? You think you're really pretty? Oh, myself. I'm Wanda. I'm. Uh... I'm irritated. <laughs> HBIC. How is anybody doing this sober? Oh, Agnes. Oh, neither for me, thank you. I don't eat food. Vision. Be normal. I'm a regular eater machine. <laughs> nice save. Norm, here's a communist. <laughs> My understanding is that it's purely for mastication. Hey, what? Oh, no, I don't serious. 
That can't be good. Bishop needs some maintenance. You are. I don't believe you. Oh, and there's, there's another paradox. It's another tear in the matrix. Oh no. That can't be good. I can't tell if she's mad or not. Okay, so remember how I said I didn't trust Agnes? I really don't trust Dottie now. She's too close. Trucker. Hydra. Make time a Hydra you. watch. I'm glad Vision's not wearing that leotard. You're right there, buddy. Get it together, Vision. Nice save, Wanda. Nice save. Another nice save by Wanda. Scale it back, Vision. <laughs> Chill, Vision. Chill. All right, Wanda's gonna come up with a save for this one, right? Ha ha ha! Stick to your day job, Agnes. The Vision could pull a hat through his stomach, but he couldn't pull that gum out himself. <laughs> Don't ask too many questions. One other day of appearing normal for Wanda and Vision. Oh, Vision, you dog. Handle it, Vision. Handle it like a man or an android. That's the same logo as the helicopter did. That's not good. No. Hey, whoa. We're back to color. Bro, what? Who's doing the <laughs> and we're back to the credits that don't explain anything either. Um, man, what can I say? <laughs> the series is committed to keeping us in the dark for as long as possible to what's really going on here. They're playing out each episode like an actual sitcom uh, with an actual story, interesting characters, and then in between there or at the end, they'll have this weird paradox where something's not supposed to happen and we're taken out of the show. So the way I see it, Wanda and Vision have either created some type of alternate reality for themselves and they're trying to keep people out of it, or the opposite, someone's put them in an alternate reality and they're trying to get out and the people are trying to keep them in either way i feel like we're in for a huge twist at the end but it's not without saying that they are actually keeping me entertained uh these sitcom episodes are actually kind of charming right it's nice to see uh elizabeth olsen and paul bettany they are selling it to me that they are actually acting as a couple within a sitcom but just as beings with extraordinary powers wanda's pregnant so we're going to get little vision wanda babies within the next episode most likely and that's going to be a little bit of a whirlwind we're back in color so i'm guessing we're going to take a step forward in the time period of sitcoms uh guys i don't know what else to say <laughs> i enjoyed watching these two episodes i'm definitely tuning in for the rest of the season if you enjoyed my reaction please leave a like and tell me your favorite part in the comments below don't forget to subscribe to catch me here for episode three next week and i'm gonna catch you guys next time peace